Welcome to the Tech Bug Buster channel, where you will learn the latest information from the world of IT, technology and the automotive industry. This is what was prepared in today's episode. Tesla has triggered a $2 million recall following warnings from a U.S. safety regulator about imperfections in its automated driving function. An NHTSA investigation concluded that autopilot was not working properly and that vehicles with the system were dangerous. This is the result of an analysis of nearly 1,000 accidents in which 23 people died. As a result, Tesla will be rolling out a massive software update to 2 million cars to improve autopilot and add more precise alerts for drivers. Reuters reports that this is the largest action of this type in Tesla's history, but it was enthusiastically welcomed by the American Road Traffic Authority as a step towards improving road safety. The cryptocurrency mining craze has subsided and miners are selling miners, opening the door to the used equipment market. There is an offer on eBay to sell parts from the unusual ASRock BC250 mining rig, built from PS5 components. Each of the five units contains used parts of the Sony console, with two CPU cores disabled, the active GPU, 8GB RAM and a surprising 40-45% to price reduction compared to the original one. Despite the attractive price of approximately $500 per unit, the cryptocurrency market makes mining difficult as highlighted by the fact that 7 of the 12 available units have already been sold. Samsung is preparing the premiere of the new Galaxy S24 series, expecting great interest from customers. The event scheduled for January 17 is to herald flagship smartphones, the most popular of which is the Galaxy S24 Ultra, estimated to sell 15.9 million units. The basic S24 model is intended to reach 13.5 million customers, and the S24 Plus to 5.8 million buyers. The planned sales of the entire series next year are approximately 35.2 million devices. Google has introduced a new repair program, offering users of Pixel phones and tablets extensive diagnostic tools, including a service mode called Repair Mode, which hides files before sending the device for repair. Like Apple, the company is expanding users' hardware repair options by enabling the use of official replacement parts and detailed instructions. This change, called the right to repair, has put pressure on manufacturers to also make parts and diagnostic tools available to unauthorized service centers. Now, Pixel phone users can take advantage of new diagnostic tools and find part replacement help through Google's improved support section. With the update, Pixel users can benefit from clearer repair instructions and diagnostic tools, which may make it easier to identify possible issues with the device. Modern TVs open the door to a variety of multimedia content, but older models may not meet expectations when it comes to smart functions. In such situations, Chromecast from Google becomes a helpful solution. This small gadget allows you to use multimedia content on older TVs, acting as a bridge between mobile devices and the TV. Available in 4K or HD, Chromecast allows you to cast content from your devices to your TV wirelessly, making it a simple and convenient option for viewers. It works via a Wi-Fi network, which allows you to stream online or locally stored content, ensuring the choice and comfort of using various multimedia sources. Asus ZenBook 14 Old, with the latest Intel Core Ultra 9 processor and Intel Arc graphics, hits the market starting at $1,500. This Ultrabook meets Intel Evo Edition standards, offering performance, long battery life and a compact design. With an old screen, a wide set of I.O. ports and innovative features such as face login and the silent Asus ErgoSense keyboard, it is a great tool for both work and play. Additionally, the laptop was designed with ecology in mind, using recycled materials in both the production of the device itself and the packaging. Thanks to the use of new materials, the battery will offer 20% more charging cycles, which, with an economical processor, old display and high capacity of 75 watt-hours, provides up to 15 hours of operation. ZenBook 14 Old has a dedicated artificial intelligence engine, Intel Arc graphics system and a capacious SSD drive, which makes using it convenient and efficient. Asus also emphasizes care for the environment, reducing its carbon footprint and meeting Energy Star standards. That's all for today. If you liked this episode, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. See you!